This video is brought to you by BetterHelp. As two people proud to be in therapy, we are proud to be partnered with these guys for the month of November. Greetings, citizens of the Reject Nation. It's like an alien sometimes. You guys are my friends. He's my friend. Nobody's <laughs> ever getting unfriended. That's not what we do. And we also don't like the dark web, but we do hopefully like unfriended dark web because that's what we're watching today. Sup, Greg. What's up, Roxy? <laughs> Sup, Greg. You got anything on the dark web? I don't even know if I really know what the dark web is. It's like illegal internet stuff. Yeah, but how do I get there? Like, is there a thing that's www but dark web? <laughs> yeah, anyone could just access the dark web. <laughs> 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 Why don't more people use the dark web? <laughs> I don't know, All you're... you gotta do is type it in on Google. It's right there. So you're laughing, but I'm still confused on whether or not I could get there or not. I'm sure the movie will have an exposition. The movie will probably say something to make it for people like you to be like, what's the dark web? This is the dark web. I've yeah. heard of the dark web. Whatever. Yeah. If you guys also have never been to the dark web like this video, I guess if you've been to the dark web like this video, just like the video in general, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Hit the notification uh, and dark web with us. <laughs> You don't want to encourage people to do that. <laughs> no, I don't even know what you don't dark even know web what the verb us. there means. No, but if you want to be the webbiest of all webs, then be a patron. That's the sexy webs. They're like web slinging webs. <laughs> Those are like where all the really cool kids go. Go to our Patreon for a full length reaction watch along where you sync up with your own copy. Greg and John cover yeah. several shows over there exclusively right. with reaction highlights. That's what I'm talking about and watch alongs included. <laughs> That's yeah. what's up. That's yeah, what's up, that's what's homies. up dark Yo, web dark, bros. Dark, we dark web in tonight, man. I want you to not look down for a second. How long do you think my intro's been? Uh, dude, <laughs> I, I've stopped having anxiety about it. Gotten used to when Roxy introduces the video, I will figure out what to cut. Should Often I be, sending should multiple I be, intros to be like, I, I managed be, to cut out 30 more seconds. Oh, but I do watch every video and I see what you cut and I like what you do. I appreciate that. <laughs> I like, I sure like what you do too. You give me plenty to work with. I have the clicker. Oh, that's the word. Oh, no. <laughs> you guys cannot see what's happening on the screen right now. <laughs> no, it's tw No, no. Okay. In three, two, one. Bird! <laughs> <laughs> There's something wrong with me, man. Yeah. Yeah. What would it take for you to unfriend me? On the socials. <sighs> Finding out you're not actually Jewish. <laughs> <laughs> that would be... You're like, what a liar. That would be trash. <laughs> Ooh, you remember that sound. If you are old enough, you remember that sound. Yeah, I mean, it's just a Mac. That's not what it sounds like anymore, right? That's what it sounded like when it was on my blue Mac. Oh, I hope, like, five-year-olds are watching this video. Because, <laughs> <laughs> like, is your password uh, just... Pa oh. No, we're trying to guess it. Maybe try with exclamation points. You're gonna get locked out. Maybe not at this time period. Quirty. <laughs> What's quirty? I think they're just trying anything at that point. Feel the burn. Big. D Interesting. Kofifi! Okay, so this is after Trump. Whoa. No shit. Your password can't even just be one. Wow, the attention to detail on this. Oh. I went to college with him. Oh, really? What's his name? Colin Waddell. <laughs> Back on the Facebook. Do you use Facebook ever? Not really, no. I had to uh, go to some event, and I had to hit yes on it recently. That's the story of how I use Facebook ever. Okay, so we're going from Nora to Matt. But is it him using the computer? Because he seemed like he couldn't remember the password for the longest time. But yeah, but it was logged into Nora, so I'm assuming it's Nora's computer. Because that he logged into it easily. Test. Uh, Maya is going to love this. Oh, he's trying to surprise her. Crap. This is bullshit. Good. You learn all the right words. Okay, so there's Maya, there's Nora, there's Maddie. 
and there's AJ. Unless AJ yeah. is a place. No, I think it's a person. There you are. Just remember who has two thumbs and gives the best massages in the world. Hmm? What? Why isn't she speaking? She's hearing impaired. That's why he was doing the sign language. Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Did not. I got a new computer today. It's much faster than my old one. Oh, and she can see it. That's cool. Oh, so cute. That's neat. So uh, well, when the app doesn't understand a word, you just you just type it in, and it automatically connects you to the ASL site, and then there's a video tutorial on how to do it. Wow, there's so many lags happening on screen right now. Uh, uh, she doesn't seem happy with this. I know. She seems extremely exasperated right now. From when you told me how hard it was for you to understand me when I'm on Skype. Are they just, like, looping her same look? Maya, can you, can you type? Her screens are kind of off. She seems so incredibly... Is she annoyed with him or about some situation she's trying to vent about? I, don't, I think she's annoyed with him. Maybe it's not what she wanted. How are we going to get into the dark web with this? Whatever he downloaded must have had like bugs or something. I don't know. Whenever it freezes, I feel like it's the movie. I know. I mean, like, I mean, like, I feel like we're <laughs> after like fix an edit. <laughs> well, the spinning wheel of death always is going to make you feel. The editing on this one already seems completely different, though. They have to do something a little stylistically yeah. different. Yeah. Updated technology. Probably was easier to match some things, but it's definitely anxiety driven. And the camera quality is really good. Oh, no. This is very odd pace setup. And they're introducing a lot of characters in strange ways. Why is he, like, logged into her stuff? Is it her computer? Because everything's maybe automatically... Maybe he downloaded something on her end, and maybe she saw something. I'm not sure. Mary Ann, I'm so... Nora. Oh, good. Been working, waiting so long. We're finally gonna meet up. Oh, don't fall for those. Oh, yeah, but remember, he's not logged into his own thing. So this is Nora writing to Mary Ann, writing Mary to, Nora, to Nora, and he's seeing it. Who's Nora? I don't know yet. I'm you. Again, <laughs> this movie makes me be comfy. I know, I know. I, I ask it, questions because they just like, introduced right, yeah. another person too. I get it. You're asking all the questions. I'm thinking, <laughs> and I'm like, what? I'm sure we'll find out eventually. <laughs> what? In the what are you putting in your gas thing? <laughs> Don't put booze in there. So he doesn't know who Nora is. Damn, this Nora gets around. Maybe it's an alter ego of Maya or something. Did you send the plane tickets? Yeah, it's obviously somebody who's like hooking up with a lot of people. Guys, I got this for Nari for her birthday because I guess I'm trying to compensate. <laughs> Hi, MTV. My name is Kendra. I live in Malibu. I'm into blank and I love to... <laughs> this one's so strange. <laughs> I don't understand some stuff that's happening. <laughs> My name is Kendra. I'm from Malibu. I'm into having on top of a pizza. My name is Kendra. I'm from Malibu. I'm really into the systematic destruction of an entire people and their way of life. This is part of their game, I guess, that they do. I can see the pores on your face. That actually looks like you're calling from the year 2018. I mean, it's a full 30 frames a second. I don't think you're ready for oh. this. I got a new laptop. <laughs> it's a refurbished laptop, and it was formerly Nora's. Yeah. Or not refurbished, he stole so, it. I don't think stole, but maybe. That's why he couldn't figure out the password. I got some killer bud. Yeah, I know, I heard you. I just wanted Linda to hear, too. <laughs> She's not gonna. She still thinks marijuana is illegal here. Damn, you're going behind your woman's back like that. Nah. This is gonna sound like a a nitpick, and it is. It cuts to the people on their on their singles before they start speaking. Yeah, yeah. And I'm yeah. like, that's not how Skype or Zoom works. Yeah. You have to start talking first before it goes to the single. I get and it, it. it. Keeps like pulling me out. This one feels like more movie yeah totally. <laughs> and, and less like i'm watching a screen recording 
but we're still early, so I'm going to wait. I like that we have one of the boxes with two people this time because at least we'll be able to see the dynamic between the two of them. Sure, yeah, yeah. Is Nora a guy? Why, why do you think Facebook and Twitter are free? Because or you're the product. product. They do yes, find very natural true. actors. Oh, no, they're gathering your data, man. There are sharks swimming below you. They're just gonna, they're gonna come in from right up behind you when you don't even see it coming, and they're just. Oh yeah, let's explore that hard drive. What's in there? Cell towers, GPS, IP address detection, Bluetooth device tracking. <laughs> For your head. Ah. Uh, huh. Yeah, a teddy bear in a survivalist bunker with a year's supply of food, guns, and ammo. I want to fix this. I want us to work. What happened in your relationship? Whatever we just saw, maybe. He didn't learn how to speak sign language fast enough? Yes. Someone clearly stole this laptop and he bought it off him. It's like all just like a side story. Is it a story? Or is no, they're just, just random people. I think it's side shit. improv or something. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So these are all things that he found. Yeah, I guess these are all the people that this Nora person interacted with. Ooh, Shutters hey, road. Cameras. Yeah, it's all. And there's all different addresses. Oh wait, oh wait, oh wait, hold on. I'm gonna play it now, okay? Check it out. I just got these new speakers. I love how he's just, whoa. Do you guys see that though? Look at my new bombs. Bam, bam, bam. Wow. Why, is, why is our guy not mentioning any of this to the group conversation? Well, he is talking to that one person on the side. Should we wait for Amaya? I don't think Amaya's going to be coming. Thank you. Bam. Yeah. It's my mom's ring. Did you ask Nari's dad for permission and did you film it? Please say you did because, oh my God, I, just, I love the look on his face. It's like you brought up a sore subject. I would really love to see that, AJ, that face again. It, it was cool when you stood up to him. That's all I'm saying. It's just, dude, dude. I don't even know the whole backstory, but I felt uncomfortable about that. Is your mom excited? The cancer's progressed. It's moved into her brain, and they have her on life support though, and they're really trying some aggressive treatments. So this just went from yay to the most darkest shit just progressed in there. But they progressed. They have her on life support. That was a wild line. I remember when I had to put my dog down. Oh my god, that was my least favorite thing people would do when my mom was sick. I, oh my god. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> I get how much people love their dogs, but it's just not the f same. God, you're so bad at this. So bad. <laughs> oh no, I am so thrilled for Oh my god, I used to fucking hate <laughs> that. Uh, They're just trying to keep up. You know, it's a game of tops when someone dies in your family. Yeah, but everybody with a dog. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Amaya's favorite sunset. This is LA. What? We have been trying to shine this world. You know. Okay, this is cute as shit. Oh. Answer, what are you doing? Look, I I I know I know you're mad at me and I know we've 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 both been busy, but I feel like I know I, I've been spending a lot of time on this app, but I've been doing it. Why can't you just type it? That is a fair assessment. Yeah, so it was about that. Finished class and you never went yet. You didn't put in the effort. Maybe ignore that shit. No, no, I'm just... Uh... Yo, stop getting so distracted. Yeah, what the hell is up with it, man? Focus up. Mm. Ma Amaya! Obviously she hung up. You deserve that. Times a thousand. And I don't feel like you actually did go to the ASL class. Man, you really have it out for this guy. No. I just don't think you went. What guy has ever scorned you? <laughs> Take it out on him. <gasps> He's been caught. No, but he didn't. He bought it off Craigslist. But that person he has, has to, to have it. Yeah. He has to have known it was a stolen laptop, though. Why? Because of all the shit that's on here. It's like not cleaned out of someone else's personal stuff. That's going to be gone. 
Oh, he didn't have one. He did steal it. Oh, did he actually steal it? Maybe. It's weird. The first movie had such a solid, easy to follow like setup in the first like five to ten minutes of its yeah. characters and the drama and what's up possibly at stake. And then here it's been like this slow reveal to understand what's going on. So I'll leave it where I found it. I'll go now. Why would you steal it and then bring it back? It's like structurally very different yet stylistically super similar. He's going to actually bring it back and then that person's going to like torture his friends. Where are you going? Yeah, 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 I'll, I'll, I'll explain later. All right, bye then. Is everything okay with us? <laughs> Sometimes that going. So is Nora's like this like super hot lesbian prostitute? Maybe she leaves it out for it to get stolen on purpose to mess with people. Is that an app? I guess. What's this guy's motivation exactly? Oh, what's that? His friend is like not asking anything. Like, why are you asking me all these questions? Wait, Matthias, what's going on? Do you want to share, share your screen, mate? Up. Oh, this is where it all went wrong. All right, that's that's an overlay network. You're being bounced around everywhere. So no one can track you. Dude, this is Darknet. It's where you find marketplaces for bad shit, basically. Like, um. I get it, but how do you get there? <laughs> the river. <laughs> You need certain devices to access it. I've never accessed it. it. Looks like an old school BBS. Charon, it's a ferryman of the dead. The ferryman of Hades who carries souls of the newly deceased across the river Styx. Six. And Sorry. Just did. <laughs> so real. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dude, whose computer did you buy? There's a cyber cafe that I've been that I've been working at. Notice this computer was sitting in the lost and found for the last three or four weeks. Wait, well, hang on, you stole someone's computer? Because I wanted a better computer to work on my app with and then- Oh, your theory might be right. When, when, I, when I went on Facebook, all of this stuff out of filled. It's a fake name, guys. It's Charon backwards. Nah, he's the smart one. He's one of them and whoever they are, they must, this is where they meet up to trade. I'd get rid of that computer and stop sharing the screen. One of them was actually sending me private messages earlier. It was uh, Sharon 68. Poor schmuck never made it to 69. <laughs> I hope that was not scripted. I was looking around and I found this uh, this folder, right? It was hidden, invisible, and it's got videos. 960 gigs. Show us. Why are you still wow. on this river thing? He is very intense, that one guy. That's here. That's the ones on the east side. and. Oh, they're hacking people's cameras. Hackers drive through neighborhoods trying to scoop up Wi-Fi addresses of any unsecured or vulnerable routers so they can... Hackers can activate the camera on laptops and phones and disable the indicator lights so you wouldn't even know that they were on. Damn. Did you open that link in the folder, the one called account? Wait, that, that's just from a couple of minutes ago. It's cryptocurrency. That's $10 million, guys. We'll take it. It's almost 11. Free money. Just sitting there. No, no, there's no such thing as free money, AJ. Facts. <laughs> there's, there has to be a way to just take it. They're trading on the dark web via Bitcoin. Ask for more. Type uh, for what? <laughs> no, no. I have no idea what he's talking about. Trephination. The sound effect of whatever something went through is hilarious. A surgical procedure in which a hole is drilled into the skull. Ooh. You do it to yourself? Oh, shit. Ugh. Oh. Ah, oh, this Nora person's awful. Oh, this isn't settling in a very different way because it's preying on something very real. Sharon 68, the first thing he wrote was that he liked the last contribution. Go back to the video folder and scroll all the way to the bottom. Or filter to date created first. No, Matthias, don't open it, please. No, op just, op just open. Why would you want to see this? Oh, 45 minutes. Yeah, this is the rest of the movie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then just never log off. I <laughs> just want to keep watching. Wouldn't they be able to trap? 
truck where the laptop is? Uh, that's horrible. This is really unsettling. Why is everyone so quiet? I think they don't know what to say. Oh, God. Oh, my God, they're going to bury her alive. It's really good at being very creepy without showing much. Oh, okay, no, I can't. I can't. It, yeah, out of this it lets you fill in the rest. Yeah. It's really clever. Yo, our homeboy seems way too curious about all this. I would not be. I would, I would stop. What would you do, though? Call the cops? I'd get rid of the laptop, yeah. Get rid of the laptop and then what? I would call the cops, yeah. Get rid of the laptop. Take it to the Don't police. Don't they need the laptop? Take it to the police. Okay. What, what, what am I going to do with this? Show me the most recent one. Sorry. But let's not forget there's got to be a supernatural element to it. Because there was the first time? Yeah. I don't think that means that there has to be this time, right? They did have that deep, the Charon thing, whatever that was. Wait, wait, stop. This can't be real. Set up a camera in the house to break in and do that. Let's see if we can see who did Why it. is he looking at the camera? That was it, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, then he might not have her yet. Um, that's why. He chooses a girl, shows her to the rest of the group, and waits for someone to pay. And someone just paid. Oh, well, we have her address, so just we can do a reverse phone lookup. Do you think they're going to go after Amaya? I thought they go after Amaya. But no, they would know if that was her bedroom, though. Oh, no. Oh, no. She's not trying to get a hold of him. To go to her house. Kelly? Oh, someone's broken in. Kelly! Oh, that is creepy. Hey! Oh, damn, I'm so worried. Is Amaya with you right now? No. I mean, I just got in. I think Amaya's in the shower. Can you possibly get it for me right now? Wow. But I can hear you. Are you still there? I can't see you. There's a lot going on. I know. The editing is jarring in a weird way. Sometimes it serves it, and other times it's like, whoa! What the? Oh, no. Kelly! Kelly! Oh, my God. Is he still logged into Skype? Yeah, I think this entity travels via this way. What do you mean? I don't feel like it's a person really going to... I feel like they travel th via through the screen in some way. You don't think they found the Amaya's address? Oh, okay. I hear what you're saying. It's not... Nef I don't know that it's wrong. <laughs> it's not my interpretation so far. Amaya, 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 oh Amaya, Amaya. Oh, she <gasps> and she's hearing impaired. You know, like, it couldn't have been her messaging because she was in the shower. Don't go in there, don't go in there, don't, don't go in there, don't play, play, play. Come here, come here, come here. Stop, 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 stop. Okay. Quick, quick. Oh, my God. Uh, it must it must be a, a bug or something. Your your computer called mine. Uh, Ke uh, Kelly, Kelly. Just type it. Say something. She brought a, she brought a guy home. He's She's, don't, don't. No. Don't disconnect. I'll, I'll wait for you. I'll wait. I'll wait for you. Oh my God. Is he not going to tell? Why? Get there. Call the cops. Do something. What? This is so weird. Why is he just sitting there? I, I, this is so confusing. I don't know. They yeah, have. I'm a little bit. Some of the choices are a little odd. Please, please, just please don't hurt her. I'll do anything you want me to do. I will do anything. I promise. A black mirror. Yeah. That's how I think he found Amaya's place. Whoa, that distortion of the screen is really odd. Yeah. So they're here to save someone's life. Wait, just one second. Can you wait? If all he really wanted was a laptop, he would have got her from the coffee shop. Now, I don't think this is, I feel like this is probably some kind of entity. 100%. Or he was lying about it being at the coffee shop for weeks and he took it. Dude, he can see you messaging that. We called the police. No, we're not calling the police. We're going to the police. Okay. No, look, we don't but you need to trust us. No. Get the laptop. Go down to the police station. No. I have a friend that will meet us. We can. He knows how to deal with this kind of we situation. Can, yes, it's not real. Oh my god. It's a, ga it's a game. I, I I made the whole thing up. It's a game. 
Lex, you were you were totally on to me from the beginning. Oh, he can't he can't tell them the truth, right? Right. Holy shit, Asshole. man! I guess oh that means my was, god! I guess that means it was pretty good. Huh? Matthias, this is not funny. <laughs> <laughs> It's, it's, it's an alternate reality yeah. game. Like exactly, that. yeah. I love how he's appreciated this idea. <laughs> Where'd you get those videos? That is some dark shit. Yeah, yeah. no, I know. It's just um, horror films. Horror films. What if we'd call the police? Ideally, you would you would register to play with your, your cell number. So if uh, by the time you logged in, if you called 911, it would hack your phone and you would get a recording like, <laughs> like the bad guy hacked, hacked wow. into your phone. Wow. He is a masterful liar. Yeah. Especially in a high situation. That's why I'm wondering situation. whether he didn't, the laptop wasn't actually sitting there for. Now convince somebody to come to you now. The storyline's much more in depth. How it builds this, this, this special bond, the ability to, to communicate with, with someone in, in a special way that would. I'm really scared of Maya. Oh my god. <laughs> what? This is just so much. <laughs> or anything the way I care about you. The night we met at the bar, I, music was, was so loud and that a beautiful person wouldn't be able to hear you anyways. It's so loud. <laughs> that all that noise wouldn't matter. And that's what I want for us. Nothing else to matter. I want nothing. She seems happier. Her smile is a good indication. I need you to get here as as fast as you can. Okay, take um uh, take take the subway, okay? Oh no! And this is a desperate isolation situation. <laughs> Mama, how's my mouth? Let's view your mic. Oh, oh my God. Yeah, you are louder than her. <laughs> All the actors are good. I just don't not really as connected to the group dynamic. I don't really know why they are and why they are the way they are. You know? Well, they seem like better people. <laughs> Fair enough. You know Fair what I enough, mean? Sure. I'm going to be honest. I, I was totally there. <laughs> but they, he can see your screen. Oh, shit. That's who was messaging. Wow, he was one scroll down from seeing office. Say if we had decided to do something with the bad guy's money, if we'd taken it, then how does that ripple through the rest of the story? What is he thinking about with the money? Oh, I think, I think, he's, I think he's trying to threaten. Good. <laughs> Watch this. Little cinematic glitches. Are they? Bitcoin is the cause of all bad things. Oh my god. Can you just do that? Apparently, yeah. Dude. You get the computer back when I get Amaya back. You get the money back when I see on the news that Erica Dunn is back home safe. Uh-oh. <laughs> All I want is my laptop. All I want is a Maya. You don't understand. You killed Kelly. No, I didn't. If you lay a hand on a Maya. Shut the f up and listen. The people I work with, all the other Sharon Primes, they monitor all Bitcoin accounts. They're going to think I'm trying to cash out. Oh, great. So now they're going to hurt a Maya. It did feel like a, a, a little bit of a rash move. What's going on? What's happening? I, 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 don't, I, don't, I don't know. Oh my God, now he's got to work with this guy. Hey, you know what? I'm just, I'm going to close it. No, do not close it. They're going to know you're not me. Are they talking to you? What are they saying? Yeah. Oh my God. They're saying, they're, they're saying recite the code. Oh God. We just put a bullet in our head. You stupid. Oh my God. The voice is disappearing. Mm -hmm. He's becoming a human being. If they find out that I lost that computer, they're going to kill me, they're going to kill you, and they're going to kill anyone else that might have right, seen so it. Just give, just give me the code. <laughs> what? You killed Kelly. No, I didn't. I just bashed her head. She'll wake up and think it was a, a robbery or something. We have no time for this. They said this is your last chance, Sharon 4. <laughs> Sharon 4. Type A, B, Y, S, S, U, S. Wait, they're, they're typing in all caps. Should it be in all caps? Just send it. 
Why did you join your account? Tell him I switched from Bitcoin to Ethereum. I wouldn't have said I'm switching. Just use his exact words. You're asking why. It's a better exchange rate. I got a tip. Why don't you share this information? If I let Erica go, they're going to lose faith. They're going to hold me liable. You'll have $10 million to help you figure out how to disappear. If anything goes wrong between here and there, you're both dead. He's just going to kill him anyway. Like, why wouldn't he just come and kill both of them? He's obviously willing to kill anybody, so. <laughs> I found the girl. Matthias, from your video. She's real. Her name's Erica Dunn. Ladies, stop. <laughs> Where did you even get the video? Live leak. Yeah, some, someone on the inside just must have, must have leaked it or something. I don't know. Why would you use that video? Yeah. He's like, oh, ladies, cut it out. <laughs> Stop. Style it back. <laughs> trying to save a life right Who's now. That? Oh, great. Oh, we're back to the first movie. How do we get this person off? Does anyone know how we get this person off? <laughs> oh, no. Stop Wait, that. what's going on? Come on, Matthias. Oh, shit. The dark web people have hacked them. The link. Do not uh, click no. the link. Do you hear me? Guys, we didn't click the link, but the video is playing anyway. Oh, no. What the? Where's Lexi? Senior year, that's December dash at McCleary's pub, yeah. Oh, that's so scary. That is scary. What? I mean, they're- Just like they're, how they're, they're finding they're, they're them, showing they're how they're, they're, yeah, yeah, they're revealing how they got them, yeah. Wait, guys, where's Lex? Oh, she's, um, I don't know, she's probably still uh, getting the bollocking from mm, Lex! Hmm, are college friends, okay. Where is she? Okay, I am- Is she in on this, Matthias? What's going on? No. <laughs> oh no. Oh my God. Is that Lex? Must be. Oh, you guys are all dead. Like a thousand percent. How close how close are you to the subway? Can you stay on the call? Just just keep your keep, keep your phone in your pocket or, or or whatever. Just 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 stay on, okay? Yeah. Who are you calling? I'm calling Lex. Don't. Listen to me for a second, right? No, no more calls, Ooh. right? We just, uh, you can, you can leave your phones on. Feel this person stressing. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Hang up the phone, no, Nori. I'm not. I'm gonna call the police right now. Calm down. Just give me oh, no. a second, please. Just Impending second. doom. That is real. The whole thing is real. Oh, my God. He can hear and see everything, all right? He, he found Amaya's apartment. She was the first person I called, so he must have been able to track her somehow. Or, or... I don't know. I don't trust that one guy. I feel like it's a big ploy. Okay. The guy who's like, who's took the money from the Charon guy, the laptop oh, owner. Oh. How do you know he's not listening now? Because yeah. of, because of Facebook chat, the green light, it goes off when she loses connection. That's why I told her to take the subway. But what about the other people? When she went underground, then I could tell you guys what was happening. All right. Look, there's, there's no service in the station. Oh, they're hacking his, the computer via through there. Okay. Yeah. It might've happened when, when he didn't have connection or. <laughs> oh shit. No, he's got a girlfriend or wife, right? Mom. I was upset. Oh, is it? <laughs> I think. I don't know. That he said he wouldn't, didn't want to smoke in front of. Jesus Christ, Mom! This is Mom. <laughs> <laughs> Man, Maddie, you are so dead. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> Please. Oh my God. Couldn't he have sent a text message? No. He's like, his phone is not connected, though. He said he was watching him, though. They have cameras at his place. So, uh, who wants to go first? Oh, my God. I'll go. They're being so awkward. Be, be better actors. <laughs> she especially is <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't want to put up with this bullshit right now. My gym teacher got fired for adding blank to the obstacle course. Too much cocaine. Velcro. Depression. <laughs> I like Velcro. Thought depression was pretty good. <laughs> All right, I'll go. <laughs> In his new action comedy, Jackie Chan must fend off ninjas while also. Hey, uh, Nari, we're trying to play. Uh, a, a horse with no legs. Her boyfriend showed up. Uh, going, around, going around punching people. And where's Lexi? Oh, they didn't see where Lexi went. Wow. Oh, uh, yeah. Give me access of laptop. System preferences, users in groups. Add user. Make sure you give me administrative access. You guys, my friend on the force, he's coming over here. So. No. And you and your mom get the hell out of your house. All right, you're the only one who might not be safe. Damon's in London. They can't get to him. And Nari's got a friend on the force, so, so the cops are already on their way. Him being in London doesn't feel like a... 
Oh, no. Did it break down or did they do something that hacked the subway? Serena Nari. Serena. Guys. Hello? All because you stole a laptop, dude. Nari's skipping this round. Okay, how much longer? How much longer for... Where'd the subway break down? Let me, let me just, let me ask. Purge. Ah! Come on. <laughs> Where did you break down? In my bedroom. Uh, at uh, Western Boulevard. That is in Hollywood. What's going on with Nari? Bathroom. She's not feeling well. It might be a while. What was that? It's the cop. The way of AJ. So sick and tired of all you sheeple not- They're gonna show how they're gonna find him. A storehouse of assault weapons and explosives. This is this weapons and explosives. Weapons and oh, this poor guy with the conspiracy theory channel having this all happen to him. Oh, how what a taunting maneuver. Can you state the nature of your emergency? I am sick and tired of all the corruption. Sir, is this a real emergency? I'm gonna pack up all my assault weapons and explosives. Go downtown to the mall and Oh, how cruel. Jeffcock is a family name. Wow, that was just so recent. They made that call 10 minutes ago. AJ, you need to- Please, we have a search warrant. No, I- Hey, AJ, AJ, AJ just, get, just get on the ground. Oh my God, they're gonna kill him? Oh, wow. What a cruel maneuver. Right here, what's on the screen? It's AJ's desktop. Illuminati. They're AJ's computer. Oh, they're, they're lo oh my God, they're putting things on his computer. They're downloading stuff. They're downloading. Oh my God. They're going to download gunfire or something. They're going to play it. Wow. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I knew it. No. No, no, no. Stay. No. AJ. Oh, they're so taunting. Oh, that's so mean. No. That was horrible to watch. That was the worst one yet. Oh my God. Wow. They're like going up against a secret society. No. <laughs> yeah, they know. <laughs> as soon as that train reaches the station. No, I Nari is on her way there. No, oh my God. It's I nice. can get there faster. I'm going to go now. Oh. oh, they're all getting axed. The great words of John Humphrey. Ugh. The other people didn't deserve it. I don't think this really matters least, on the deserve. No, the other people more deserved it, but it was still like these people are good. Oh, uh, you mean the movie? <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, they meant the people like, here. No. <laughs> do you want to not tell them tonight, or, or what no? It's perfect because this way, they get to be there for the news. Uh -huh. AJ will be fine. He's a big boy. Oh, uh -huh. quickly do they scan their shit? You would love that, uh -huh. or with a boombox, just John Cusack <laughs> style. <laughs> We can't hear him, but he's trying to talk. They're only daughters, so. <laughs> Wait, mom. No. No, she has to Why are they playing this back? I think they're about to go find her at the hospital. It's going to be about her mom. And we can bring the paperwork. And <laughs> In the ICU? And she'll be our witness. Yes, yes. They're going to say where she is. I don't want you to have to choose between me and them. It's not fair. They're going to make her choose between her and her mom or something. Yeah. Oh, she's gonna get pushed in front of the train tracks. It's gonna either be her or her mom, or I think it's gonna be a cho choice. Yep, there's her mom. They're gonna try to kill one of them and make her choose which one's to save. Yeah. <laughs> Who would you choose? Her mom is going to die. Yeah. Right. So you choose your girlfriend. It's horrible, but that's what you do. Stop this right now. I will do anything. Oh, man. So in control. <laughs> I love how there's a personality to it. I think they're going to kill both regardless. <laughs> no. No. I won't. Demonstrate as much strength as you think you are. No! <laughs> oh, that is cruel. Wow. That guy behind her is just no. going to turn around and push her. Yeah. No, I did it. Yikes. Did the guy also die? Looked like that. He's there. Serena, Serena, get out of there right now. Get out of there. Serena, get out of there right now. Oh, my God.
my God. Yeah, I see the way they travel, though, feels like not real. I think there's just a lot of them. <laughs> listen to me. I want you to listen to me, oh. whoever I'm talking to right now. <laughs> Nobody's listening to you, honey. The guy who lost it, he's, he's on the subway train with her. He's wearing a gray hoodie. This is all his fault, okay? She has nothing, nothing to do with it. Yeah, what an unflattering shot. I hadn't seen that in the theaters. <laughs> <laughs> Her whole performance this whole time. Like, uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, speak in sign language that they don't understand. I'm sure they could interpret it. Oh my god. No, they're not going to be able to. He needs to just talk to her. Yeah, I really got to learn sign language. All right, you're going to get her, man. Yeah, I am. Well, just make sure you leave the computer open because I gotta keep downloading the video files. Oh, okay. <laughs> Do you think he's in on it? How great would that be? You're there, aren't you? Oh. Bait laptop. Guess what? I've been recording. You should have dealt with Matthias. Who was gonna give the computer back? But that is not what I'm gonna do. This is everywhere that computer has been. This is gonna lead them to Erica Dunn and every single girl you took. They're gonna come right into his place right now. Photoshop. Oh, they're gonna Photoshop his face on it. <laughs> they are so evil. <laughs> I can't get over it, man. Oh my god, how cruel. Oh, they just have some like weird ability. They're gonna plant things there. They're gonna plant the girl. It's Erica Dunn. Do they have some like weird software enabler on their, their bodies, in their bodies yeah. and their cells <laughs> that can? He didn't lose the laptop. Sharon Four. He left it there deliberately. He wanted it to be found. They all wanted it to be found. See, it was a lure. Yeah, to pin it on him. It was a lie. They're setting us up. We did everything they wanted us to do. We moved the money. We copied the videos. They're gonna make it look like it was us the whole time. Oh my god, was it my head on it? I'm almost. I'm a second away. I'm a second away. No way. Inside where? Inside where? Your home. Well, we had our first kiss, Amaya. Ah. Uh. Oh, Maya, I, I, I didn't, I didn't send you anything. <sighs> oh, this poor woman. Is Maya gonna help? No, 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 no! no, no. Oh my God, they think it's him. Damn, why'd they choose these guys to pin it on to? Because they saw him at the shop every day. I don't know. It's just such an icky ass experience. Because they knew Damon was a tech guy, so that he'd have the capability when they looked into it. Oh my god, they're at his home. Yeah. Oh. The confession letter. Holy shit. How clever. Because remember, he downloaded it all. What a proper setup. Oh, she's in the room that with the canister initially, remember? Yeah. But how do they travel? Like they There's a lot of them. Hi. But how, it's it, game night. I assume it they can sneak night. up though. It's game night. It's game night. It's game Oh, she's here to bear too, yeah. <laughs> oh, this is their game night. Oh my god. This is their effing game night. Wow, how many people? That's what I'm saying. There's a lot of them. Is it the girl from the first movie? No, it's Erica Dunn. Why would it be the girl from the first movie? <laughs> Ooh, the, the drill thing. thing. Head, yeah. Oh, my God. Don't pull it out. Oh. Ugh, the horror of that. Let him die. It's going to be die and then it's going to cut. Yeah, so many now. Yeah, see, like, how does he not hear a fan <laughs> coming his way? Remember, they have to show their faces every time? 
That's the, like, insurance policy? Yeah. <gasps> Women, too? Game night. Wow. That was wild. Cops in on it. That was wild. Wow, it's interesting. There's not a supernatural element this time. I didn't think there was going to be because dark web. I felt like that makes it more susceptible to have a supernatural element. You know, things happen to a lot of people in this. <laughs> they do, man. <laughs> Honestly, I think that there, if any of them had made it out alive, there'd only be one solution for them. Oh, what was that? And then they need to talk to somebody. Talk to what? Like a therapist? <laughs> Clearly. <laughs> I need to talk to a therapist. You need I to talk to a therapist. therapist. Everybody needs to. Oh, you know what? That actually gives me an idea. If you just step out of the video for a second, I could talk to the audience. I think it's really important to play them and then come right back and we'll act like we never even lost time. I got you. <laughs> <laughs> Today's episode is sponsored by BetterHelp. I know that we often joke around here quite a bit on the channel, but I wanted to speak a little bit more sincere during this specific sponsor. And I'll start off by saying this, that, you know, with any sponsor, they usually give like suggested things to consider uh, when talking about the sponsor. And one of their suggested things was, was a question that they had there that went along the lines of like, have you ever laid awake with your thoughts racing, wishing for a moment of silence? And I thought to myself, well, the, yeah, that's my secret cap. <laughs> I, I know that feeling way too well. And it's in those quiet moments where you're battling your own mind, where you are seeking clarity the most. And you may have heard me talk about this on the channel before. The better part of a decade now, therapy has undoubtedly been one of my main anchors. Before there was ever the real rejects, I was diagnosed with PTSD, type 2 bipolar, and ADHD. So uh, needless to say, I needed some therapy. And through its guidance, I've unearthed deeper layers of myself, cultivated richer relationships, and just have a more profound understanding of my emotions. And one of the best parts about it is it's given me a space where it's free from judgment, where I've found my voice and learned the art of truly listening, not just to others, but also to myself. And I've talked a little bit about how this year I've focused a lot more on my physical health and hitting the gym a little bit more often. And in all sincerity, I do view therapy as like the a gym for your mental health, a place where you can really nurture your mental well-being. And it is an experience that has been quite transformative so much to the point that, you know, I would say at least half of the people that you see that come here on the channel are in therapy. As a matter of fact, I know one of them, their therapist is with better help. I often joke that like I've been in therapy since it was underground. <laughs> Why I joke like that is because I, I see now in the past few years, a lot more people have been going to therapy, which is fantastic. I love seeing that. So I will say that if in your heart, if you have been seeking therapy or contemplating going to therapy, I highly encourage you. I urge you to consider better help. Before I ever saw some ad for better help, I had heard other people who had been with better help and had really given strong in-person testimonies to me. Their online platform is crafted with care, keeping your comfort in mind, starting it as simple as answering a few questions. And really important to remember, it's a journey. And I really love this because I've had uh, at least like three therapists in my life. So if you ever feel the need to change your therapist, BetterHelp understands and allows it without any fuss. Trust me, that's a massive benefit. So for a journey of self-discovery and mental well-being, turn to BetterHelp. Embark on this heartfelt joyage at betterhelp.com. That's H-E-L-P dot com slash rejects and embrace 10% off your first month. Genuinely, thank you to BetterHelp for sponsoring this video. It's weird. I thought the first one dealt with a more serious, probably a more relatable subject matter for more people. And yet, and, 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 and something that was a much more sensitive subject, I think, the first one. The, just like the, the premise of like, go kill yourself on the internet, go on alive yourself. Yeah, yeah. And the cyberbullying and all that. Like these are like dark web activities are very much real. Um, however, I think like that one's a little bit more. Yeah, I would say I would say like a little bit more. Like you you can connect with that or empathize with that more because we're, we're a little bit more privy to that. My girl's yet, last name was Rittenhouse. Yet I thought the first one I walked away with like that was fun, <laughs> and this one I was like this is a really uncomfortable experience. Well, yeah. the, the first one was targeted, right? We knew why by the end. Why them? This one, it's just like you know, things happen 
and wrong place, wrong time. And they pinned it on them for funsies. Just scary, creepy. True. Really creepy. Wow. That's such a bummer for Rebecca Rittenhouse. Why? Because of Kyle Rittenhouse. Oh, really? I don't know. I, d- I don't think they're related. I'm just saying yeah, I wouldn't want the last name of... Anyway. Uh- <laughs> you should see my friend Stephen Dahmer. Yeah, I think that would be a bummer. <laughs> yeah. That would really be a bummer. Yeah. Um, or George Hitler. Have you met him? Is that real? Yeah, he's my neighbor. Are you being serious? <laughs> oh. Could have kept this big going for a while. That would be crazy. Um, yeah, I would have changed my last name if my last name was Hitler. Yeah, I would hope so. I don't know. I think like, I'd be like, don't have a sense of pride, my friend. This was really creepy. They did a good job. It was different. It felt like different editors because we did spend a lot more time away from our computers in this one. Yeah. You know, like there with the flashing different videos and stuff. We did do that last time too, though. And I like the dynamic of having two people in one. Yeah, but the the fact that none of them had like wronged each other and it wasn't like uh, as much about that and more was just like, we need to pin this on you guys. Ugh, creepy. Yeah, I think s- structurally, I-, I feel like I could have used a-, a tiny bit more, like in the first like 20 to 30 minutes, I found myself just trying to play a little bit of keep up with what's going on. Wait, what did it just say? The story name are, are all uh, fictitious. Oh, fictitious. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. What do you think it said? I don't know. Usually at the end. I find at the end of things, I, I didn't know if it was saying like based on a true story. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, I think I think in like the first twenty to thirty minutes, structurally there were, I could have used a little bit more, kind of a personal investment in in these in the people first. It like because it, it, there comes that point where he stops the breakaway. And he's like, yeah, there's something happening on my computer. I bought this computer off Craigslist. There's this thing happening, and that's at like the thirty minute mark in the movie, right? And I I did wish that we kind of got clued in a little bit more to the personal dynamics between them, other than just sort of the surface level stuff. Yeah, but I do them. I I definitely hear you, but I do think it's interesting that you were asking significantly more questions than normal, and I think that was maybe the purpose. Like the first one sure. was much more straightforward. This one wanted you to fig have it unfold as it's unfolding for them, kind of. I agree. I, I I I do think that there was a a world where I could have had because I was more just like I was more focused on like understanding the information and plot and less so having like an an emotional investment and that but that emotional investment eventually did come around at like the halfway point in this movie um and I think the world of it was very well done at, at first I was sort of getting the impression that they had stylistic choices first that they wanted to toy with, and then they were building. They like a, the filmmakers. Yeah, and then they built a narrative around that versus the reverse. You know, I felt like they were first leading a little bit too surface with like its gimmick and what other neat way can we do it? But then eventually, I really started to feel like the story of it all and the the intensity of it unfolding. Like I, th- I think like as it escalated, I love, I really love the escalation of it. Like when the dark web circle people came in and just started hacking their Skype chat, I'm like, that is really scary. And I thought that was genuinely a really scary and felt more that, that felt more like uh real and tangible. Like the, the last movie, you just start going like, it's gotta be supernatural. Like, you just feel that it's probably supernatural. And then this one, I think that's why it's a little bit more icky because even though the subject matter in the first one is a lot more sensitive, this this feels like there's a world here where shit like this actually goes down. It kind of reminded me of Purge like at times with like the the elitists and like this being their game night as we were getting towards the end. It kind of did feel like that. Do you think that you would... Black Mirror meets Purge. Yeah, yeah. Do you think that you would have thought that this was because the whole time you were like, there's got to be su- supernatural angle. If it wasn't for being a sequel, would you have thought that? No, I would have thought. Okay. That. So it was only because like usually in a franchise, they kind of stick to that same 
level of supernatural, whatever that level is. Yeah, I mean, there there are times here where it becomes a little bit. I don't know, honestly. The thing is, I really don't know. It, there are things that register to me as sci-fi. I would say, like, like the glitchy cameras every time they walk in the room, kind of thing. I just think yeah. that there's something in their pocket or whatever. <laughs> yeah, there's something there that would happen, and on the text messages when they would. It would delete. It would always have the woof, like this jittery thing. And whenever they talk to the chat, the the charons, there's always this like thud sound effect whenever they enter. And, and I couldn't tell if that was a filmmaker choice or if that's what our character was also hearing on his end of the screen. There were there were things about it where it would feel sci-fi to me, which would make me think of like a Black Mirror. Um, and that's why I would sometimes be led into thinking that there's probably something supernatural also happening. However, the short answer to your question is, yeah, I definitely mm-hmm. I definitely found myself going down the rabbit hole of thinking there's some ghostly entity element more because of the first movie. Did um, you like this even in the same category as the first movie? Like, I, I think that you like this one less, but did you like it close to as much or for you was the first movie just a significantly better movie? I think the first movie is a tighter film. I think the first movie is a stronger film. Um, but there are elements here that I really did love. Like the, the last half of this movie, I loved. I really did. Mm-hmm. I, I, it just took I, a long time to get there. It took me, I was really thinking like, I'm not sure I'm going to lo- like this movie because <laughs> like, because I wasn't giving a shit about anybody. Whereas in the first movie, we did like you and I were both going back and forth like, wow, these people feel so even though even though they're all assholes, <laughs> like even though like, as the movie kept going, you find out they're all dicks, you they felt so real and you felt like you really got to know them um so early on that I was more attached to it and, and the mystery around it I thought was more alluring right off the bat. And there was also a personal tie in to the thing they were enveloped in Mm -hmm. and to me this the sensibilities of that choice and dynamic just make for a more engaging story for me personally but the subject matter of this and uh the cleverness of this and also the the fact that it feels real really spoke a lot of volumes to me and and made it icky like i i i think you and i were having like different responses when people were kind of getting killed because i was going like, this is so evil, but I was having fun with how evil it was because <laughs> it was just like, damn, Everyone these guys were watching him hang, guys, and I was like, can't believe they're showing us this. And you were like, <laughs> I was like, yeah, this is fucked up, man. <laughs> like, this totally. is, like, this is so cruel and like, they're so clever. And uh, yeah, that was, I thought that was really neat. I thought it was but what did you th- What did you think, though? Did you prefer it over the. I think that, you know, the first one, because we really went in super blind. We were, it was like threw us into this world, which is unlike anything I've ever seen in a movie before. So it's unfair because I'm biased that the first one to me is just like incredible. I just thought it was so wonderful. I think this is the best version of a sequel they could possibly make though. That's good. That's a good point. Because the first one, if we just saw it again, but with different friends Mm -hmm. and the same kind of hacker who's like out for vengeance or whatever, it they did that version already and they did the best version of that movie. So I feel like they, they was smart by making it dark web because they went after people who didn't necessarily deserve it. They had this, like it was kind of this larger world. The reason it reminded me of purge is in the first purge that I watched, it's just in the house. And in the second purge, we go out into the world and this kind of felt like that. And the first unfriended were just, it's an isolated story. But in the second one, we see this is game night for tens of thousands of people voting on who lives and dies and how. Uh, and it just felt like a more evil society and world with the Chirons. And I think that that was really clever and different and the best sequel we could get from this, even though it wasn't as innovative as the first one because I hadn't seen a movie like that. Yeah. To me, it really just comes down to the, 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 the I keep bringing it up. The investment of the of the core cast of characters, and it's not it's not solely like just to comp- because like I said like I agree like a thousand percent with everything you're saying. You bring up some like really really strong points, 
And especially for like, what would you do in a sequel? Yeah, congratulations, Rob. Yeah, Greg, let's go. Greg likes your point. Let's <laughs> go. <laughs> it is a question. Greg of like, thinks I'm smart. smart. <laughs> <laughs> he <knows> I win. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's that, and it's not. It's not. I'm really. I'm just using this as a way to not not to compare. Just to use as an example of. I guess it is a comparison. Ultimately, uh, the I really felt like in the first movie that ensemble were real friends who've known each other a long time, you know. And then here, I felt cinema. <laughs> I felt actors uh, cast. While they were all great actors, I thought everyone did a a really great job. It never quite reached the level of i believe the history of, of them it still felt like i was still aware i was watching actors i hear you we did yeah. spend less time also developing that history you know i think we were an hour and 20 minutes in when you were like oh they went to college together <laughs> yeah. you know and it's like okay so in the last one we obviously knew who like as the secrets are being revealed but like this person hooked up with this person this person doesn't like this person like as somebody was brought in the group they're like oh my god she's the most annoying one of all of us you know here it seemed like they were all kind of like equal level friends yeah and you couldn't really tell what the dynamics or intricacies of their relationships were as much yeah uh, and i i think that the actors did an amazing job too because there's no real conflict between them mm -hmm. whereas like the first movie there's a conflict between them well there's conflict between him and amaya but we also still like uh but it, but it kind of felt underwritten yeah yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah totally they were like we know we need a conflict between them <laughs> yeah. which is why she won't go over there but what is that conflict <laughs> it's going to be very brief uh, uh still cringing over me in the first minute of this being like, why isn't she speaking? <laughs> so far. <laughs> They're like, oh, like if there's anything they really set up. It's, it's you were she. like, what? I don't know. Sometimes you know how it just takes you a minute when you're watching a movie to like get into it. And I just, I was seeing everything that was happening, but it just wasn't clicking for me. Story of my life. Uh, okay. Those were our thoughts. Yeah, overall, I'd still give it like an 8 out of 10. Yeah, me too. Honestly, I think that this is a cool franchise. Is this the second and last, or is this the second? I think this is the last one they made, and I don't really know what the hell I would in order to like, what do you pitch for a third one? Something Zoom, something uh, pandemic-related. I feel like this might have been it. Come on, Roxy, do your thing. Look at that. Look up, I'll look up for you when it came this out. This wasn't pandemic-related. I mean, I f this, this feels like... It was on Skype, so you know it's not pandemic-related. You're right. That was Zoom, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> um, when did... They could theoretically just do a movie that takes place during the pandemic. Yeah. Right? That's what I'm saying. They're all on Zoom wearing masks. Mm -hmm. When did Unfriended... I'm going to say it took place in 2017. Yeah. Maybe... 2018. 2018. Really close. Because I remember you reading 2016. Yeah, yeah. Unfriended 3? Let's see if there's going to be a combo. They did a... Oh, they did, they did a, a thing called What Rhymes with Roxy. Foxy. Uh, no. <laughs> Moxie. <laughs> Keep going. Soxy? Because there's like barely any words that rhyme with Roxy. There's like a few words. Coxy? <laughs> Proxy. Proxy. <laughs> Jesus. I said the ones that come to mind for Coxy. <laughs> you got like you got like three to four words that were right with you. <laughs> what about proxy, bro? <laughs> They did something called Unfriended. I don't know what these are. I don't think these are connected. There's one called Unfriended Proxy. It was a short film that they made in 2020. Did they make it or somebody made it? I don't know. Well, let me see who wrote it. No. No, I think these guys were trying to rip off the franchise. <laughs> Actually, is what I think we're looking at. I, just to be 100% honest, I would thrive in this franchise. All right. Yeah. Way to audition yourself. Yep. <laughs> Because I would be like, what rhymes with Roxy? Soxy. All <laughs> oh, that improv for <laughs> like a fan out. <laughs> okay, we got to get out of here. We do. Uh, that's it. 
Yeah, that's it, man. Okay, that's it. Peace out. <laughs> <laughs>